Take five. Welcome to Yolanda's crochet corner. So I got happy mail today. So if you do not like happy mail videos, just turn it off. Go watch another video of mine that I talk more about my yarn or whatever interests you. I personally love watching, um, you know, grocery hauls. I love any kind of shopping hauls, uh, clothing hauls, definitely yarn hauls. Oh my gosh. I, I have not watched yarn hauls in maybe, um, maybe a month. The last yarn haul that I watched was where, uh, my friend Heather, Heather the Crochet Witch, she, uh, she did a yarn haul, and I am shopaholic and a yarn addict. These two do not go together. <laughs> so, I watched her video, and I had to go and buy yarn. So, I said, you know what? No more yarn haul videos for me. I'm not watching them until end of December when they're selling nice yarns. Anyways, so why are we here? Happy mail. Yes. Um, so Heather told me, I think yesterday, she said, hey, you have a little happy mail coming in. I'm like, awesome. Who does not like a happy mail, right? So... Oh, and she said, like, definitely. No yarn, don't worry. I'm like, okay. Uh, I love yarn, but I I have no space for it anymore. I'm, I'm actually getting some space now, since I'm using it up. Anyways, so, happy mail. So the mailman comes to my grooming shop and he goes, hey, your package is here. I'm like, well, it's definitely not Heather's because she um, she just told me that yesterday, so I assumed she shipped it out yesterday. I'm like, well, maybe it's my grooming tools. I had some uh, grooming equipment ordered. So I go check the package, and yes, it was Heather's without even seeing her address. I knew this. I knew this. Because only she puts supernatural stickers for me. Oh god, I hope I did not flush her address. I don't think I did. Well, if I did, I'll make sure to blur it out. I cannot do take six. I'm, I'm done. So you guys are here for the blurbs or what do they call it blurbs anyways I'm tired so I'm talking a lot and my tongue is just like blah, blah. my tongue is not listening to me where are my scissors hold on where are my scissors oh well, that's not good I had so many scissors okay found it Sorry, guys. Oh, my couch is a bit of a mess. Mess as in my cover is not up. Like I said, I was not prepared today. That's why I got no makeup. I have a little makeup, like a uh, little eyeshadow and eyebrows on. Anyways. Heather. What did you do? If it's not yarn, what is it? What is it? I'm very curious. I am really, really curious. Because she said there was no yarn. I see purple. I see something purple. I see something purple. I see more purple. I see more purple. Wow, you guys should see me opening 
this envelope. Okay, you, you're probably thinking, why didn't you just wait until your day off, be all ready, and your mind is not exhausted, and you're not doing nonsense with this package? Well, because I cannot wait to open it. Like, I... I could barely wait until end of the work for me to um, open this package. So there was no way on this planet that I was going to wait three more days. No way. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Send me more of the... Oh, yes. Okay, so... I'm type 2 um, diabetic... And she got me special diabetic socks. Let me read it, but she sent me those. Yep. Thank you. They're not tight, so it doesn't cut off your blood flow and stuff. They're very comfortable. She sent me a few pairs, a few. She sent me a whole freaking box of them before. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I love them. <laughs> I love these. Look. Oh, I love these. Oh, that is nice. Oh, wow. What are you? Wow. This is very interesting. No, these are expensive, by the way. These diabetic socks are very expensive. Oh, my gosh. I am going to rock these out. Oh, my God. I wish I had these for uh, when I went to... Uh, Florida. Excuse me. Probably would have been way too hot. But look how cute these are. Look at these eyeballs. Oh my gosh. Jelani, my husband, will want to put googly eyes. Oh my gosh. He, oh my god. If he's gonna glue googly eyes, I'll be so pissed. He loves googly eyes. So whenever he sees like anything that has eyes on fabric, he's like, you must put googly eyes. He's gonna put googly eyes. I need to hide them. Of course, I have to open all these socks now because I want to see. I see purple and I see a ghost. Oh, yes! Halloween socks. Yeah. Oh, and the weather is definitely at this point where you need socks. I do like... I never had such a long, long socks before just because... They're very restrictive, I guess you could say. My socks are usually like ankle socks. But I'm going to love these. Oh. Oh, yeah. I'm going to rock these out. I'm going to rock them um, with my um, Halloween costume. And I'm going to rock it out. Oh, these are going to be super cute with... Uh, I have a long black sweater dress and I have a thigh, not thigh high, um, they're supposed to be thigh high boots, but I am 6'2", so thigh high boots are more like up to my knee boots. <laughs> so these are gonna look awesome with these socks on. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna rock them out. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Girl. Girl. Oh, look, I don't want to take these out, but look at these foxes. <gasps> yes. Yes, these are so comfortable. Like, even if you're not diabetic and um, you need comfortable socks, these are it. They're called Diabetic Socks Non-Binding. And I cannot pronounce it but here's the name and um, she sent me some of these before just um, like that normal length socks oh where did I go yellow there we go and my mom asked if she could try them because she's diabetic too and she absolutely loves them um, my feet doesn't have much issues yet um 
and me with my, the way I eat and what I eat more like the way I eat um my swelling is not bad at all like I don't really have swollen legs or ankles only if I'm working a lot but my mom has awful issues with her legs and feet and she loves these socks like she has she, these are the only socks that she wears now anyway some leveling too much but if you're a diabetic if you have feet issues swelling issues these are amazing oh these are so summery oh god did you send these for jelani look at that flamingo Jelani is not diabetic or anything. He doesn't wear. He doesn't really wear socks. He wears certain socks, but okay. I'm just kidding. But he is obsessed with flamingos. He is obsessed with flamingos. He keeps threatening me that he is going to uh, buy one of those yard flamingos, like the huge ones. And I'm like, no. He said yes. He still has not bought a yard flamingo. I hope he never does. Oh, I love... Oh my gosh. Look how cute that is. Thank you, Heather. I will not have to buy diabetic socks forever. Or any socks. These, okay, I used to just buy whatever socks... But Heather has converted me into diabetic socks just because, like I said, they're really not restrictive. And I have a big foot, so these are so Halloween socks. Love it. Love it. They're so soft and so stretchy, too. So, like, I have big... I don't have big as in, like, fat calves. Like, I, my legs are very athletic. So, majority of the weight where I carry is my back and my belly, but um, my legs are very fit. They are pretty lean unless I am... But just because I'm 6'2", my legs are just, like, large. So, it's hard to find um, socks that fit comfortably. These are so loose. So nice. Love these. All right, what else did you do? What what did you do? What did you do, Heather? Okay, I see a lot of... You are gonna get me into crafts. Oh, notebook. Yes. I already finished up. In one happy mail, somebody sent me... Oh, I can't remember her name. Sent me a um, notebook... And that's already filled up. So I get another notebook. I like the colors. Oh, I like the colors. Neon. Since when do I like neon? I don't know when did I started to like neon colors. Love it. It has lines. I don't know if you can see lines, but I promise you there are lines. One thing that I don't like about this notebook is that it's it's not thick enough. It needs more pages. <laughs> Let me know where did you get this notebook from? Because it needs to be thicker. <laughs> I didn't know they had such notebooks before. I never seen one like that before. I love these colors. Okay, I don't know what's with me in neon lately, but Holy moly. And I can't wait start to start writing stuff in it. I don't know what I want to write in it, but I want to write things in it. Never. So she sent me a... Where did you get these Supernatural stickers? She sent me a card. And it says Maverick picked this one up. Picked that sticker out. 
she has a really adorable pity. I think it's a pity mix. She's super cute. It's in a lot of her videos. Oh, if you don't know who Heather the Crochet Witch is, go check out her channel. She's actually really fun. She does a lot of videos. I don't do a lot of videos just because I'm busy. That's all I gotta say. I like I'm busy. I don't have that much crochet stuff. <gasps> to show. Oh, that is cute. Did you make this? Did you make this? Don't lie. Okay. It says happy Halloween. Oh, look how pretty this is. It shows up so bright for, oh, it shows up so bright for you guys. Like in reality, it's way darker. It's toned down like so, so pretty. I love, 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 love this card. It's really pretty. It's not even a card, it's decoration. You know, a lot of people say like, oh, I save all these cards and stuff and I, like, what? Like, I never find the appeal of the cards. Like, it's nice, you know, like I, you know, but some people just save them forever and ever and this one I am saving forever and ever. I have one card from my mom. It's a card for our wedding that I'm saving forever and ever. And this one too because it looks freaking awesome. Oh, you didn't make it. I just looked at the back. Who made it? Who made it? Ohio. Okay. All right, Ohio. You, you know Halloween. Because this is pretty. Look how pretty this is super pretty I want to put it on my window I do not like these open windows because at night time it's kind of creepy it's my backyard but we don't have a fence so when I watch scary movies all I can think about is somebody being behind my window and watching me I love scary movies I've been watching scary movie every night but I cannot I get scared so, I need a bunch of pretty cards. Now, watch me. I'm going to start to go hoarding cards. But nobody sends me any cards. So, I'm going to start hoarding cards and put them on the window. Anyways. Oh, my God. How do I manage to make this video so long? It's... Mm, I don't know if it's okay. Well, the card just says, Thinking of you and sharing some Halloween spirit. I love the card it says happy halloween halloween happy anniversary you remembered you remembered me and jelani got married on halloween so it's going to be our first anniversary it says love heather maverick and otis oh love you too guys Ah, oh, you remembered our anniversary. Thanks. You know, talking about anniversaries and getting married, you know what's really interesting? So, I have family members and friends who got married with these huge weddings, beautiful weddings, spending tons and tons of money, as much as a house, you know, and they, the marriages failed, it just things don't work out, and, and they, you know, it just, and uh, me and Jelani, our wedding was not fancy at all, because we had uh, no friends here in Indiana, we, we didn't know anybody, so only my parents came, and we just did a court, you know, court marriage, we just signed the papers and got married. In a court. I did got a wedding cake and it was of course uh biker style, Halloween style bike. Surprise, no kidding. I don't know if I can read this.
Oh, I love the notebook. Like I said, uh, the only thing that I don't like about it is that it needs more pages. It needs, like, to be this thick. I am obsessed with these colors. I... Whenever I go shopping and I end up in the section where they have um, printing paper, pens, pencils, scissors, you know, calculators, they always have these printing papers that are all in all these colors, and I want to buy them just because I like the colors. But then I'm like, what the heck am I going to do with it? Love the notebook. Love it. Thank you. Yeah, I I love the stocks. Thank you so much. Uh, those are not cheap either. Those, those are pricey, but they're worth it. They cannot wait to wear them. Especially like our house gets pretty cold. So I love how the bottom is thick. It's, it's much thicker than other socks. Anyways, okay, enough of me talking about socks. You know you're getting old when you get excited about socks. I mean, who does not get excited? I don't care how old you are. How do you not get excited about freaking googly eye socks? Jelani is going to put googly eyes. I know he will. He can't help himself. He's such a kid at heart. I love these socks. Thank you, Heather. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the happy mail. This is... I'm saying this not because you send this... I'm saying this just because this is so my vibe. This reminds me of my crochet blanket. Like, the, the cover is all black. And then, bam! Oh, you say I'm a goth. You say I'm a goth and emo because it's all black. Ba bang <laughs> Bang all the colors. Anyways, I'm sorry guys. You guys are probably annoyed by me today. I'm tired. I'm ready to go shower and go to bed. And today was also my fasting day. Mm. I'm going to bed, going to the shower, going to bed. So I can wake up tomorrow in the morning and I can eat. I'm looking forward to that. Love you guys. Thank you, Heather, so much for the very surprised happy mail. I can't believe it came that fast. When did you ship it out? Anyways, thank you. All the kisses to Otis and Maverick. And I hope you're enjoying your concert. I wish I could have gone with you. But work, you know. <laughs> Bye, guys.